How goes everybody? My name is Sam Tim. Welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario. In the last episode, we made it to this weird island with the Yoshis, and I just kind of cut back to um, the room or the area before the town. And so we have a little Yoshis here. This is my work to Lava Lava Island. This island's almost entirely covered by a thick jungle. Still, you can beat the living crap out of everything. <laughs> I didn't get to that last part, because I don't really care about it. Uh, people who talk. I guess that's a really bad thing about uh, me playing RPGs is that I don't read what everyone's saying and I'm like, oh, what the fuck am I supposed to do? Ah, you come seeking help. Why, you want to go to my lava lava, do you? Mm, the entrance to the volcano is in the jungle. Very difficult to get to. The volcano has awakened as well. I think it may be too dangerous to go. It's too dangerous to go alone. Take this. Nothing here, it seems like there would be. This village leader is my friend. I mean, hello, how are you? Anyway, ever since he was a child, the village leader has a very strong sense of personal responsibility. When I heard he was going to be the village leader, I wasn't surprised at all. Alrighty then. We got a little... Ooh, did not expect it to be there. We got a little raven here? Oh. I guess. No, <laughs> I mean, it looks like a raven. But, uh, can't check it out or anything. So let's not... Ooh, hello, Mr. Worm. Kawiz, it's everyone's favorite quiz master, Chuck Quizmo. Then let's get to the question. Question. What ability does you can buy a fragrant loose? Um, it would be Tattle? Correct, you got it right. You are not a complete idiot. Congratulations. Here's your star piece. Yay, and we get a star piece, which... Uh, yeah, so... Uh, I was gonna say, I did explain that, right? Yeah, I'm like 99% sure why. Uh, and star pieces are for they're either currency if you miss that they, they're currency to get badges from Merle right is it not Merle Merlo Marlo's now hi hello howdy this is Yoshi's village <laughs> not a very not a very good accent for him uh, besides the leader said there's not to get too close all right. I'm um, kind of skipped through this area pretty fast. I want to see these. Come on, die! Want to die? No, I have to make them die. They wouldn't die. It's it's a it's a fuzzy, except it dies. No, <laughs> I'm clearly ripping that person off. <laughs> I'm cheap. Looks like you could get back there somehow, but there's no those little little like extensions of the world. If you mean like this thing right here. If you, if you get my drift, wood. Is it wood a weird word? Wood. Caw! Um, alright. Caw, caw, caw! Oracle of the Stars, Mario comes to this island. Mario is fated to be Master Raphael the Raven. Caw! Caw! Are you Mario the Master Raphael the Raven song is about? Um, can I talk to this guy? Is he Raphael? Can I, can I knock him down or anything? Hello? Is anyone there? Is this the police? Yes? Well, fuck you! Uh, can, can you shed some light on this? It's Red Tropical Restore at <laughs> Atmosphere here. Sorry. The Jade Jungle. What's Jade about? Is it it's green, but I don't know what Jade is. It's an emerald. Can we explode you out of there? No. No can do! Ah, great. Great, great. Oh, it's Mario on Adventure or something, right? Wow, cool! Oh, uh, who's that with you? Is that your partner? I mean, I wish I could be. I can dream come true. The grown-ups won't let us out of the village because they say it's too dangerous. Then Cheap Cheap's always watching us. So, is it Big Brother? We'll see about that. Us guys of Fearsome Five, we aren't afraid of anything. Okay, that's interesting. Interesting, at least. And this is this little inn I was talking about in the last episode. The toes are fresh to take a nap, and we go to bed. So this is very nice. I think something happens when you wake up. Maybe. Did you get some rest? No. Um, I don't. Because I know what happens, but I don't know how you get it to happen. Maybe you just have to leave this area or something. Um, can I... 
Oh, it's so rare to have visitors these days. Ah, this is not a good voice. It's a girl. I'm watching these boys who are very, very naughty. I can improve it to you, but I bet they're planning something. Well, I think they can't fool sushi. I'd better think again. Or they'd better think again. Ooh, this music. Oh, there's the bad ones. Oh, it's gonna be one of those days. It, it has been one of those days for me. It, it has. It's been one of those days. And you must explode it. <laughs> Instead of you must whip it, you must explode it. You crack that whip. You must whip it. There is something, what is it? If I, sometimes if I'll say something really fast, oh shit. Either, I don't remember what the fucking movie is. It has Tim Allen in it. And it's like making fun of um, Star Trek. But the aliens like talk really quickly. They're like, mm, you're my savior. And we must help you. Which reminds me of that song. You must whip it. Crack that whip. You must whip it. Anyways. Ah, uh, die. No, you don't die. Well, I don't die. You die. I don't get poisoned either. And you are dead. 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 You are dead. 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 That you were hot. Guess what? You're not. Hello. Well, thank you for that heart, dear lord. Wait, can you just give out more infinite hearts? Holy shit. Uh. Okay, so. It's like every now and then or something? I don't know. What's back here? Some money? Ooh, I'm digging this music. I don't remember it being all that great, but ooh. Well, that was, um. For, wait, so what did it what is it actually doing? Is it making us one dimensional? Because we're already two dimensional. That doesn't a whole lot of sense. That makes my head hurt. Like what it, is it just like it actually seems like it's just flipping us the other direction, if you know what I'm saying. Like, we're still well then we would be one dimensional. Because this is a two dimensional plane and you can't have depth. So I guess we are becoming one dimensional. Right? Yeah, yeah, I guess. But you can still see a little bit of me, I don't know. Oh, I don't like these things. I remember you have like a lot of fights in this area, if my memory serves correctly. Speaking of memory, I had a psychology test today. It shocked. 80 questions in only less than 60 minutes. That's some bullshit right there. Um, hopefully she curves that. But if I let you yawn when it's only fucking 3 o'clock in the afternoon, when it's more like 3.34 p.m. On this lovely, lovely Friday. Does it, I feel like, does this music not like keep going after the battles or does it like start over once the battle ends? Well, I'm not 100% on that. Hey, look at Blub Blub back there. Anyways, um, I feel like this is a maze, sort of. Maybe, maybe not. And then there. Well, it doesn't seem like we go anywhere else. And those little platforms is where sushi comes in just to... Just a little spoiler for you there. It's not that much of a spoiler, but a uh, spoiler never the less. And it worked good. I'm watching these boys. I can prove it. Well, uh... Anyways, the same shit she said last time. Oh, it's Mario. You're looking for an adventure. If you want, we'll go with you. You won't have to worry at all. The fearsome five got your back. Let's go through the jungle. We're not scared. We just can't ever go out because the metal's some old cheap, cheap. So she's a nanny. She's super nanny nine one one. Oh yes. Oh super nanny nine one one. Oh, was that even what the show was actually called? Or was it just nanny nine one one? Something like that. Yeah. No. Um. Something I've been wondering, can you text 9 like, so if you didn't want to call 9 and like, let's say you wanted to text so like you're quiet or something, could you do that? I'm not going to try, because I don't want to get fined or penalized for, um, 
uh, whatever that law is, yeah, calling forth of emergency services without need, or, I don't, I don't know what the actual thing is called, so, the can do, um, he said he was making for my lava lava in the path, and halfway there, I wonder how far he got, we're almost halfway there, er, halfway there, er, halfway there, seems like, uh, there's more over here, is this what, uh, was talking about with Colorado. He help! He he help! Help! Um, let me guess. Yes. Unfortunately, and what is wonderful? How did I know? Well, let's just go through some of this treasure before we help him. Bump bump dum bump bum 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 bum. Um, what? Why don't you do your little lick, sure, John? Little shy guys. Wait, how the shy guys over here? How did they get to the island? Kind of like um, Jason goes to Manhattan, you know, like Manhattan Island. Jason. Yes. Um, if they had, well, I was gonna say if they had cell phones. Like, no, I'm pretty sure they didn't have cell phones back in the '70s or the '80s or whenever the fucking movie was made. You know, like, I'm gonna say like late '70s or something. Anyways, phew, you saved me once more. You top notch, Mario. Now, uh, or is it would it be Mario? The volcano is quite near. High press on spirits are high. Eh? Probably didn't understand at all what I was saying. High spirits are high. Eh? Well, that seems fun. Um, can we knock this tree down? Nope, no can do. Um, I remember, yeah, you can only get so far. And nothing in here. Ah, uh, Mario! Hey, have a look at this, old boy! It looks like the same music we played in the first, um... Uh, ch chapter, place, like, dungeon. Seekers of an ancient civilization lying there, and yet I can find a way in a bit of a sticky widget, eh? I shall not give up. A good explorer never stops gathering information. Let's get back to the village to look for clues, old boy. There must be a way in there, and my, there must simply must be. Colorado, you thirsty. You one thirsty son of a bitch. Son of a bitch! So, let's head back to... The Will. Stop! Um, yes? Oh, you think I was beaten by an enemy again, old boy? It's just a bit of a joke, old chap. So, us must have a sense of humor, don't you know? Don't you know? At any rate, let's move on, huh? You, you cheeky bastard. You. The music's different. Um, let's take a little nap. Oh god, looks like they're all fucking flipping out over there. God damn. What the hell happened? I know exactly what happened. Um, but, uh, let's see. Let's, let's see what's, uh, their, their dilemma. You get some rest. Good luck. Ding, good luck. Or, or look. Ding, good luck. And do nice little save do. Hello. The kids are gone. The only place they could have gone is the jungle. I had a feeling they were up to something lately. But I thought it was just a mischief. I didn't know they'd go in such a dangerous area. What do we do? How do we find them? Oh, my. Oh, it's such ill out. Ill fortune, the children are missing. They seem to have secretly slipped off into the jungle. They don't know it's dangerous. We must get them back to safety. Mario, can I ask you to look for these lost children? Um, okie dokie. All you know, all you can see, the Yoshis of my village are panicking. Let's try to calm them down. Just find those kids. Thanks. Hello. It's terrible. It's just terrible. It's terrible. All the kids are gone. We told them a thousand times to have to go into the jungle. Sushi went after them. She's cheap cheap who always takes care of the kids. How could this have happened? There must be a reason. Mario, please help. Look for the children. Calm yourself. My goodness. I swear all these natives are so panicky that they can't get any information from them. I guess someone had better solve the problem so we can quiz them, eh? You. You are an asshole, Colorado. I am sorry. You are an asshole. Ka! Ka! 
Um, you say all the same thing, walk all the stars, and I'm gonna assume the other one just says the same goddamn thing. Well, uh, come on, what? Let's go try to find the kitties. Um, well, I'm not... <laughs> I feel like there's something more to that, though, than just smacking yourself on it. Maybe, maybe not. I guess not. Well, let's go. Find sushi. Get back here this instant, you little ingrates! Ingrateful humes! I actually wrote, wrote that down on something one time, a little quote by me. Not quote by me, more like Fran in Final Fantasy XII. This is so embarrassing. I'm stuck in this tree. How did you get in a tree? Just pardon me by asking. How did you get in a tree? And you're down. Good. You need to be in water, though. Oh, phew, I'm saved. I feel like I'm one big ache. Thanks for getting me out of that tree. I'd be okay now. Oh, those little... I was chasing those nine little Yoshi boys, and I fell into their trap. Okay, well, that explains it. They went to the jungle. We have to find them and, and before they get too deep. It's dangerous out there. It's dangerous to go down to Tadis. Um, so we got to find him. Oh my, how impolite. I haven't asked you your name. Why, pray tell. Mario, huh? Hmm, well, I've never heard of you before. Really? You, you, you've never heard of Mario? You've never heard of Mario. You've never heard of Mario. How have you never heard of Mario? Oh, he can die. Well, that, ex well, that explains it. Well, as a cop, what dirt in it? I call a cup of dirt. No, that that's so funny. Well, explain it. Well, it's a cup with dirt in it. I call a cup of dirt. Just head on down the line. Just head on down the line there. Um, blah blah. Can we pull you out per se? Maybe, maybe not. Um, hello. I saw oh, what's up. Thanks for waking me up. This sounds so nice, isn't it? It's a perfect place for napping. Perfect temperature. I'm a blub blub. My job is filled well with flour. I'm gonna take this seat. Or rather, that's what I want to say to you. Unfortunately, the seat isn't quite wrong. Yet. Oh, that's, that's what I thought. I, I, I remember you had to, like, come back here at the fucking end of this chapter. It was kind of stupid. But that leads us to chapter six. Because this one's five. Um, so yeah, this is chapter five. Have I explained that? To maybe, maybe not. Next one with flowers, and I, I, I actually can't wait for that one because I have some decent memories with it. I mean, all decent, but they're good. They're good and safe. Good and safe. And do you have to do your reading? No. They, I what? I remember the sixth one taking like a while, sort of. I mean, not a while, but um, I don't know. It looked like it. I don't know. Just fun, I guess. And you only get, uh, that's our last character you get is in six, I'm pretty sure. Well, let's show off how the sushi do. Uh, the sushi does the squirt, um, hold and tap, okay. Um, I don't follow. What? So, I'm assuming that didn't work? I was like, I put it all the way to the end and I started tapping. I don't know, maybe, I guess I did it wrong or something? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. But you can't have some other bullet! What am I doing wrong? I genuinely don't know. Okay, well, you need to block that too, Sam. Besides that, I don't, not really 100% sure what I'm doing. And here's the belly flop. Well, this one's pretty good, I guess, is one of my... Uh, I like it when you have to use this stick thing for, um, your attack. Those, that I find easiest to do. Or pull off, like, uh, uh com well, that combo. Is it a combo? I guess. It's just me saying it's stronger or not. So, I don't know. Well, but that's actually gonna do it for us today, my homebrews, because we're out of time. 
But in the next episode, we're gonna find those Yoshi boys and bring them back to their mommies and daddies. So then, my homebrews, I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful life and good bye.